we run it as a county, most of the time the, 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 the uh, residents don't want to pay back. They feel like it's our money. Yeah? So we said we will run now this project to the banks yeah. so that they can also be able to collect the funds uh, on our behalf. Yeah. So that uh, us as a county will uh, be able to subsidy the, 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 um, the credit facility. When they get 8% maybe the county will bear the 3% so that yeah. it's paid low but also the money is collected. The previous fund, people have borrowed and they're never paid. So now you're matching the bank not only to get a better implementation service, but also to be able to get more funds, assess more funds, by uh, uh, getting uh, a much, uh, a much run to the banks. Um, the other project which I really Sorry, think... And how does that complement with the hustle fund? Because that's now launching its MSME um, phase. So will, will people be able to choose to do the, the scheme or <coughs> This comes direct from the county. The only thing we are trying to do, we want to use the model of the Hustler Fund, yeah. that you can access the fund yeah. through uh, digitally. Yeah. You can get digitally instead yeah. of uh, all this uh, bureaucracy yeah. and paperwork, but through the bank, so that uh, also when we give money, we get the money back. If it's a revolving fund, it's always very difficult that when the money goes out, doesn't come back. So that's why we, we invited the professional uh, in the banking yeah. sector, because that's not our work, yeah. so that they can assist us. Yeah. But they're not only assisting us on running it, they're also giving us funds. Yeah. Because we are giving 150 million, they're giving yeah. us 700, five, five more. So it we, means we can assess more funds yeah. than before. Um, but most importantly also, when it comes to value chain, this country, has a, uh, a big potential, especially where we are going now to launch the mm -hmm. mango drying uh, process. Uh, uh, process. Sure. That area, that area is the most famous place in Kenya on pineapples. Yes. So the best pineapples in this country. So I was speaking with the, uh, the team uh, when we met uh, last week. Yeah. But one of the areas we should start speaking also with those investors uh, being assisted in this factory uh, to start is to start thinking on how they can expand to now producing also juices. Mm -hmm. I think there's a plan. Yeah, yeah. Because uh, it, will, it will be really, if we do mango, well, especially for the Magarini area, yeah. pineapples will be really a big thing, mm -hmm. which I really can to happen. But most importantly also, in this county, the biggest cash crop has been for years in that is mm -hmm. cassava. Mm -hmm. yeah. This county has a big potential for cassava. Yeah. And every time we are rushing on maize, we are rushing on uh, all these other uh, foods. But I can tell you, cassava over the years has been a, a, a very good uh, 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 crop which uh, could sustain also people. You could, it's, it's, a, it's a stable food, has been a stable food for a long time along the coast. Cassava is indigenous? Uh, yes. Yeah, and they, and they, it does not need much rain. Right? The moment you put the seeds and you have one, uh, then the rest goes. It can go in the forest. Yeah? The, the challenge is good. We are starting, uh, the, 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 my predecessors have brought uh, some machines to start off a uh, 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 cassava uh, factory in near position, which never took place. We are now running to see how we can make this possible and start also recruiting farmers. Among the seeds, the chief officer was saying we're giving at the moment is cassava uh, uh, stems.